F1 then then is a nerd. Kill you. Cringe. Good thing you're a normie. I'm not like- What qualifies you as a normie? A person gravitating to social standards, accepted practice, and fans of their own time. Fads of their own time. I don't think I fit those. I'm not like a no I'm like a normie on social media. If I speak to like NPC normies, like the people in the real world, people just walking about, I get the TikTok trend of like everyone's an NPC walking around of like NPC response or what or NPC streamers or whatever. But there are just people walking around in at uh, midday, just walking alone, doing things, not just shopping, just doing random shit. What the fuck are you doing? How? That's one thing I have I don't understand. I'm go if I leave the house, it's to do a thing. And I am so dead set on it. The reason I don't normally get recognized in public, I will wear like either glasses or sunglasses and be in like a baggy top and a jacket and a hat and just walk down looking at my phone. If you've got if you see me in real life, no you didn't. Like I walk through the world like this. There's no shot. There's no shot you're recognizing me. The, I got recognized in the Apple store purely because I had to put my email in. I bought a fucking, I bought an iPad recently and I don't use it. I don't know why I keep doing this. I always think that an iPad will benefit my life and it never does. But I bought like this iPad and this guy like had a moment of like, I gave him my, I, they like, oh, type in your email. And he you saw like Finster A and he had a moment of like, girl. Like, he handed me the phone and everything, and I like, I paid, and he said, okay, just pop your email in here, we'll send you the receipt. And I handed, I went, great, held the bag for him, he took the thing back, and he went, uh. And I, I was like, I'm alright, like, thank you, bye! <laughs> like, that was it. I was wearing, like, my, I was wearing a hat, big jacket, just, thanks, dude, thanks, that's so sick. Whatever. Typical male, task-focused attitude. I don't... Is that- that's not a, like a- is that a guy thing? I guess it is. I feel like the- now- the, dude, I can't tell if I'm- am I gonna be like- am I gonna be like all- all fucked up now if I- if I say that, yeah, to, I guess the people that I imagine in my head that do that are women? Is that bad? Do you have social anxiety? No. I- I- I'm pretty normal socially. Like, I'm not quite like, juicy, like Robin. She- has this absurd, like, social confidence. I don't know how. I think it's because they're a cosplayer, and they went out in cosplayers, and that must have, like, that must have helped you. Because, like, when we were at Insomnia, a bunch of people were in, like, seats and we wanted to sit down, but there was a gap between every other seat. So, Robin walked up to these, like, people on this entire row and just said, like, Hey, our friends want to sit down. Can you move over? Asked, like, 10 or 15 people to move, and everyone in the group was just staring at each other going, like, what if they fucking, what if they, dude, what if they murder us? What the fuck? <laughs> Why, how can you possibly do that? <laughs> what the fuck? We were all like, we were just cringing, like, like, but everyone was doing it. And she had such good confidence. No one cared. I, and also, I wouldn't care if someone told me to move, but I, I could never do that. I have a normal level of social confidence to the point that I can approach someone and talk about whatever. And I'm pretty decent with small talk, but I couldn't ask someone to do something. Whatever that level is, no. Didn't Finskimp score really highly on that autism test? Yes. What about it? <laughs> I got 198 on that test. I got 198 on my IQ test. I have never done an IQ. I did an IQ test once when I was like, I think 14. That number keeps changing whenever I talk about it because I don't actually remember it. But I asked my mom recently and she said I was like younger than I thought I was. And I got like 115. So average. <laughs> I got an average IQ when I was 14, which is pretty sick. It means I know I'm not that dumb out of a thousand. It's not a fucking score. IQ tests are quite shit, I know. They also said that I was dyslexic after that, so apparently I did really bad in one of them. <laughs> 115 is above average by one point. Sick. That, that's how I describe myself. I'm smarter than like 51% of <laughs> people. I'm smart enough that I know I'm dumb. That's what it is. I was 15th percentile or something like that, which I think, hold on. I don't actually remember the actual thing. I, th I They just said that I was I, 15th percentile in IQ. Yeah, that's one, so I'm top, no, that doesn't mean top 15%, because 15, like, you could be 15th percentile at the bottom or the top, so I don't know actually what that equates to. It's like slightly over average. There's no way I'm at that now. I think my IQ's gone down, dude, because I stopped, like, studying when I was, like, 17. Like, I, I dropped out of school.
Finn has bimbo brain? Oh, definitely now. IQ doesn't measure intelligence. I didn't know that. <laughs> so I don't know, man. I'm Look, whatever IQ measures, I didn't do all that great. I don't know, man. I'm pretty content with being average. It's good. It means that, like, I, I'm not, like, I, I have a good, pretty good appreciation of people that are smart, and that's it. And, and I don't recognize when people are really stupid. I think that's a pretty good way to live out the world. You are anything but average. I know, I'm fairly below average on titty size. <gasps> What's the average boob size? 34 double D! Average bra size in the US is 34 DD. In the UK, the average is 36 double D. Yeah, what? Ah. Oh, shit. That's completely false. That's, listen, man, that's what Google says. In the UK, average bra size is 36D, and data shows that this has increased from 34B in the last couple of years. What the fuck happened in the last couple of years? When did titties get that big? The majority of men and women prefer an average breast size, apparently. Nice. Hormones in milk. Fake titties. People got fat. The pill. I don't love the conspiracy theories. Titty- the great titty explosion. How much is weight fracturing? I don't know. Gay frogs. Chemicals in the vaccines. Femtrails. Ice cream and apple pie. Uh, it's the hormones they put in the chickens. Implants. I swear to god I read that as immigrants and thought that was really way funnier. <laughs> I like just conspiracy theories. Aliens. Eggs. 5G. <laughs> I love that. The pyramids. Probably something like that. Um... Why are you shirtless? Do I look shirtless if I go- Oh, chat, new stream idea. Hey chat, what's up? Hey- Oh wait, hold on. Can I like cover- which- hold on. Wait. No, oh, that one. Hey chat, wait. <laughs> what's up, boys? You like boobs? I'm so- I'm- oh, don't look at the clothes. I'm so- I'm so naked right now. Wow, ho, wee. New thumbnail. Also TOS? How is this TOS? Wait. <laughs> okay, I'm done. I'm done with this. This is a bad bit. <laughs> I'm so surprised you didn't do the black bar stream, but yeah, I know. I quit. Oh my god, TOS. How is that TOS? Fixed top. Bro, you made me so fucking scared. You made me so scared. I ju you can- you could genuinely see a little bit of panic in my eyes when you said fix the top because I went, oh man, I forgot that's something I actually have to worry about now. Oh, What top? Yeah, what top? I don't know, I'm wearing- <laughs> What company doesn't like people who get erections often? Ubisoft. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> it's like a battle pass caption, in all fairness.